Hello friends. With you as always short cinema. Today we have a comedy movie called The Good Boys 2019. The film describes how a guy named Max moves into the 6th grade and plays an online game on his laptop. In it, he chooses an orc woman as a character and enlarges her breasts to the limit. Max likes the result so much that he decides to immediately deal with this matter. But the whole process is spoiled by the father who appears, saying that he is leaving for the weekend and forbids his son to take a flying plane without him drone. In the next scene, Max is riding a bike with his friends, Thor and Lucas. They called themselves the Couch Boys. Teenagers say that it will be much tougher in high school than in elementary. Day passed. In the morning, the guys go to the park, where Max admires Brixley, with whom he is secretly in love. Popular guys come up to the guys, where the most important was Atticus. They take the guys to a secluded place and offer to drink an adult drink, to which Thor states that he has drunk it 500 times. Everyone takes a sip, but when it's Thor's turn, he gets scared and refuses. Atticus and his friends laugh and mock the boy. Next, we see Lucas returning home and eating his favorite lasagna for dinner. Then parents come and suddenly declare that they are getting divorced. At school, when the guys sing in the choir, Lucas begins to cry, but he does not tell anyone about his parents' divorce. After a while, Thor wants to sign up for an audition for a school musical, but Atticus notices this and starts laughing at the guy. Thor, fearing disgrace, abandons his idea. At recess in the school cafeteria, another popular student, Soren, invites Max to a kissing party where there will be many girls, including Brixley. Max wants to call Lucas and Thor, and says that he will look after his friends, as Soren thinks they are stupid. After the lessons, the guys go to Thor to get ready for the party. Thor takes out their parents' rubber doll, and the friends practice on it. Max starts with a passionate kiss, but she has someone's hair on her lips. The guys understand that they need more practice in kissing. Max, remembering that her neighbor Henny constantly comes to her boyfriend, takes his father's drone to watch the couple through the video camera installed in it, and Lauren to communicate closely with the girls. Benji was Hannah's boyfriend. He brings banned substances into a jar of vitamins and invites her to spend time together in the evening. But the girl sends the guy off, after which he leaves screaming. Hannah and her friend Lily notice a drone in the sky and catch the gadget with a net. The guys go to the neighbor's house and ask to give the drone, but the girls refuse, dissatisfied with the fact that the guys were watching them. The frustrated guys return home to Max, where Thor said that he stole a neighbor's purse, where Hannah's phone was. Friends try to open a jar of vitamins, but nothing comes out. The girls call Hannah's phone and arrange to meet at the playground to exchange the drone for a bag. When meeting Lily, she accidentally blurts out that there are not vitamins in the jar. The guys understand that the girls are very strange, that Max acts for sure, and activates the drone from the remote control. Only the student does not manage to control and the gadget crashes on the school bus. The boys run to school where they hide in the school bathroom and decide to skip classes to buy a new drone before Max's father returns from a work trip. Friends go to Thor's house, agree to sell their common valuable game card and quickly find a buyer on the internet. Worried that the customer might be a pervert, Thor brings in a cool weapon he found in his parents' closet. When the buyer Claude arrives, the guys meet him fully armed. Seeing that Claude is quite calm, the guys allow him to enter inside. However, at the last moment, Lucas refuses to sell the card, citing the fact that it is a symbol of their long-term friendship. Claude notices a rubber doll that the guys passed off as their mother and, after a little haggling, buys it from the guys for 600. The three go to the mall to get a new drone, but are blocked by girls who tracked Hannah's phone. The guys refuse to hand over the vitamins and try to run away, and Lily rushes after them. Lucas hesitates a little and crashes into a van and suffers a dislocated shoulder. Max thinks out how to get rid of the stalker and says that the girls touch them, shouting this to all the people on the street. Lily has to run away, and Thor and Max sharply tug on Lucas's arm and return the joint to its place. An upset Lucas admits that all his problems are that his parents are getting divorced. Then friends promise that they will be by his side no matter what. The guys run into the mall. But the right drone was bought right in front of their noses by two girls Hannah and Lily, who left a message for their friends. 
The guys arrive at the location indicated on the note, and confess that they lost their vitamins when Lucas crashed into the car. The three agree to go to Benji's to buy vitamins, without revealing that Hannah sent them. The girls bring the guys to the guy's house, only Lucas still lets slip that they are here at the request of Hannah. Benji refuses to sell the goods to the kids, then an enraged Max grabs a paintball gun. Max fires back at Benji's cronies. Thor misses a powerful blow to the face, but Lucas avenges his comrade. Franz grab a jar of vitamins and run to the girl's car. Hannah and Lily get their merchandise, and Max picks up the drone for Dead to let him go to the party. Except Thor and Lucas don't want to go there, as Max admitted that the popular guys think they're dumb. At this moment, Max calls his father and says that he returned early and will be in 10 minutes. Max, controlling the drone with the remote control, tries to return it before the arrival of Dead. Unfortunately, when the gadget flies through the chimney, its chamber is clogged with black ash. The boy, not seeing the screen, makes a mess in his dad's room, although he manages to land the drone in place. An angry father calls Max and tells him to urgently go home. Because of what happened, friends begin to swear and blame each other for everything. Max also reproaches Thor for not having his own opinion and he refused to perform in the choir just because the popular guys laughed at him. All three are crying and disperse one by one to their homes. Parents severely punish Max and put him under house arrest for a month. They also talk about what happened to Thor's mother, but the woman is sure that her son has nothing to do with it. Next, we see how Lucas himself tells Mom and Dad all the details of today. Only adults think that his son is stressed because of their divorce. Lucas convinces Max and Thor to go to the party. Max escapes from house arrest. Friends come to Soren's house and go down to the basement. Thor wanted to surprise everyone. He opens the bottle and is about to break Soren's record in three sips. The guy takes for sips which impresses others, and no one else laughs at him. The kids start playing spin the bottle. After seeing the first kiss, Lucas realizes that this is not for him, and goes upstairs to play video games. Brixley spins the bottle, and it points to Thor. The guy is categorically against this kiss, knowing that his friend is in love with the girl. Atticus tries to taunt Thor again, but Max orders him to be quiet. Max follows Thor and says that he got excited and offended his friend in vain. Thor believes that a friend is right. It's time for him to stop being afraid of opinions about others and about himself. After that, Max returns to Brixley and offers to kiss. The girl agrees and the two share their first kiss. On the top floor, Thor finds Lucas just as Hannah and Lily appear out of nowhere. Lily confesses that she's Soren's older sister, and that's why they are here. Learning that Thor loves music, the girls persuade him to sing and this inspires the guy so much that he goes to the audition, where he gets one of the main roles in the school amateur production, Rock for the Ages. Thor successfully performs in the production, delighting the audience with his vocal abilities. In honor of this, the family also throws a party. The three guys who have rarely seen each other in recent months understand that their lives are now going different ways. But they promise to solve all important matters together and hug each other tightly. 